A Dose of Dill is a really interesting Rugrats episode and it didn't go where I thought it was going to go, but I really enjoyed it and I thought they definitely took the right direction with this story. This is the first segment of the 30th episode of the sixth season of Rugrats and everybody is getting attention from Dee Dee except Tommy. Dill has recently had his jabs. Angelica is faking an injury. Phil is trying to pick a scab. The, I loved the way the scab was animated. It was beautifully done. Lil is just getting extra stickies, extra plasters. And everybody's getting, getting attention and Tommy feels left out. So Angelica tries to coach him in faking an injury or faking an illness. And... At the moment, I won't say what happens, but I will, with a spoiler warning, give a, an overview of what happens at the end because it surprised me. But obviously, there are some really important lessons here. The main lesson is that you need to be careful with how much attention you give to your own child's friends because they might feel left out. And you need to make an effort to at least make them feel special. I think it was Stu who pointed out that it's good that they have one child who's low maintenance, i.e. Tommy. And that may seem like a good thing, but that child is going to be hurting. You may think they don't need attention because they're not crying or shouting out, but they do. And I feel like that needed that needed to be made a little bit clearer in the episode, but I think it can provide some food for thought by showing how Tommy felt, even though he wasn't acting out or shouting or crying. It didn't mean he wasn't feeling these negative emotions. And as I said, I think it did a a really good job of, of showing that. So what actually happened? Um, actually, before I get in with that, one thing that amused me is that Tommy said uh, something like he was playing with Dill on account he went to the doctor today. The baby saying on account seems so bizarre to me. I don't know if that's something that's often a common phrase in Rugrats and I've just missed it, but it, it certainly entertained me. But as I was going to say, before I interrupted myself. So, a spoiler from now, I'm going to discuss what happens at the end and why it was not what I was expecting. So, I was expecting that when Angelica was teaching Tommy how to how to act, how to act like he needed attention, I thought that that, that is what would happen and Tommy would act out and get attention. But what actually happened is so much more moving. And he realised that he didn't need to do that to get attention because Dill will always give him attention. I still feel like the adults should have paid more attention to him. But even though they didn't do the right thing then, I feel like the message was still pretty clear. So I was I was really pleased that Tommy didn't resort to faking an illness or injury to get attention. Because that's not a good thing to do. But at the same time, who could blame him? Everybody else was getting attention except him. But I was really pleasantly surprised with, with the direction it took. I thought it was a an enjoyable episode, one that I would be happy to watch again. Uh, definitely, definitely a pleasant surprise.